Alright. There's my coils. Now you gotta go left. There's two lefts and two rights. So that you can see here. So you can tie this one to that one and this one to that one. And then those two will tie together. And there's my output. Now I put these little clamps on there because I was told that when you coil stainless steel and it gets hot, it'll go crazy and go every direction inside your tank. So I figured a couple of little bowls, a little angle iron, jimmy some holes, squeeze it all together, and you know, there it is. <clears throat> Alright, that's going right on top of that. There's going to be where all my pipes come out. This, of course, is going right there. That's my next step. I wanted to so show that just to show you how I did my stainless steel coiling. I'll be able to take that off and clean my pipes once a year or so you know right before winter maybe I don't know and I decided not to weld the water tank to where the burner is there's my joint this one is the top one this one's the lower one I just built me some little angle iron drill me a hole and I put the little spacer in here so that I'll take that apart and I can squeeze well, squeeze it down. Uh, I did it in three points. You know, tripod. It's a lot easier to level a tripod than it is a four or two. Three is always bottom. Anyway. There you go. That's my other deal let's see this is gonna be the hot coming out you know I wrote down cold there huh let me think this is supposed to be hot sorry it's supposed to be cold anywho that I caught that <laughs> I would have really messed up anyway it's all good that's it for now now I'm gonna put that that up there. So I'm having a blast. I love this.